mornings. Good morning and welcome back. I'm Victoria Idoni with your headlines for your morning. Here's what's happening this Thursday. We've moved into a new year and in cities across America, that means new leadership and change for those communities. And in Boston, workers have started removing the last tents from a homeless encampment at the intersection known as Mass and Cass. Residents dismantled tents and hauled prized possessions from the encampment. Bulldozers later loaded tents, tarps, milk crates, wooden pallets, coolers, and other abandoned items into trash trucks to be hauled away. Then street sweepers moved in once the section was cleared. So in Boston, we had an explosion of encampments, open air drug markets come to the city last April. The they all, they all happened overnight, the, these encampments. This is the city's effort to now clear those encampments and try and deal with the issue of substance abuse, meth abuse, and mental health. New Mayor Michelle Wu had pledged to get housing and support for people living in tents in the area. And a city official says more than 100 have already been relocated to housing. The city has approached the camp as a humanitarian and public health crisis. You know, I lost my job through the COVID, and it was hard for me to, like, you know, get um, get accepted to housing because, you know, the money situation, like the rent out here in Boston, is expensive to get an apartment. Even to get a room, it was expensive. 